Hi everybody, it's Leslie from Scrapping Life Away. How are you? Um, happy Christmas Eve. That's when I'm filming. Um, and actually in six minutes, it'll officially be Christmas Day. Um, it's been a rough couple of weeks in our household. Everybody's been really sick. I've been really sick. Um, we're on the mend. But I'm here to share... Um, you know, sometimes you just get something in your life that just makes you so happy and just puts a smile on your face and a smile on your heart. And I wanted to share that with y'all today. Um, my son got home from Evansville today for the holiday, um, for Christmas. He's going to be in town for a week. And um, when he walked in the front door, he said, hey, mom. There's a, there's a box here for you. Um, were you expecting anything? And I was like, no, I wasn't. So I walked outside and I picked it up and this is what was there. And I'm thinking to myself, well, what in the world? I already have one of these. And any, everyone who knows me knows I have one of these and I don't get it, you know, so then I flipped it over. And there's a happy face. <laughs> then it says mail. Happy mail. I thought, who in the world? I wasn't expecting anything. I thought, who in the world sending me happy mail? So then, as I continue to turn it over, and um, I'll cover this up. It says, Aunt Leslie. That's right. Aunt. Aunt Leslie. And then my address. Now, um, my niece, Ashley Lynn, lives down in Kentucky. Um, as a matter of fact, she doesn't live too far from Stacy Evans from um, Pink Poodle Crafts. And the next time I get down to um, visit Ashley, um, I'm going to go see Stacy and... Um, give her a great big scrap and life away hug. And, uh, anyway, Ashley was so excited. Um, she's down in Kentucky, um, stay at home mom for Christmas. Her husband got her a baby cricket, a baby bug. And then he got her the Zyron machine as well. So she shipped me this box and her Zyron machine box. <laughs> Excuse me. I have something to drink here because I'm just really, um, my throat's still really, really sore. But anyway, um, she'd been watching my videos and saw that I had a video, um, from Elizabeth Britt from BB's Butterflies with Happy Mail. And she saw that I had sent Stacy some Happy Mail. So she thought she'd send her Aunt Leslie some happy mail. And I can't tell you, this is probably one of the best Christmas gifts I've ever gotten. So I'm gonna, I've already opened this up and looked at it, but I want to open it up and share with you. And I'm going to set it over to the side here so I can pull stuff out of it as long as I don't knock everything over. First, now mind you, she is a brand new crafter. She made me this card and it says warmest wishes. She made the envelope and then she made me this card and it says to Aunt Leslie from Ashley. And then it just says Merry Christmas with this little Christmas tree on it and all the little adornment. She did this all herself. She even pop dotted up the little star. Oops, going the wrong way. I'm sorry, people. She pop dotted up those little stars. I'm so proud of her. Especially to have someone else in the family who's crafting and understands the craziness that we all feel. But wait till you see this package that she sent me. First of all, she sent me this. It's burlap. 
covered in lace. Um, Ashley Lynn, which is what we call her, it's what I call her. This is going to be a journal cover. I'm making a journal cover out of this. Um, it's just simply beautiful. So that's one of the many treasures that she sent me was this. She sent me these decorative brads. <laughs> she sent me a bag full of flowers, of paper flowers. They're just adorable, absolutely adorable. And you know, I'll be playing with these. Oh, and look at some of these little baby flowers that are in here. Look at these little baby ones. If I'm sniffing a lot, I apologize. And, oh my gosh, wait, you see these. Two, three, four, five. Yeah, I think there were five of them. She sent me these five little burlap sacks. Now, these are absolutely just adorable and I thought they would make absolutely adorable pockets in the burlap and this that I'm going to make. So there's five little burlap sacks and it just goes on and then if I can get this open here, there are little frames. These are all frames and um, I don't know if she realizes just how much this means to me, <laughs> but one of the embellishments on this, you can see it, it says families are forever and this one says moments in time. And then this one here says together, but these are metal, but, um, this just means the world to me, especially that one. Families are forever. I was just in tears, um, when I opened this and it goes on. And there's this and it's got little chipboard pieces in it and it says happy my best friend love joy best think fun smile and hello now who doesn't need a nice purse and a set of heels now I can't wear heels anymore because my with my arthritis I just can't wear them but a girl can dream Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. And then these dimensional elements. Um, I want to look at these. These, um, can't tell if they're felt. They look like they're felt, but they're um, dimensional. And this is wood. But aren't those adorable? I'll tell you what, I'm the luckiest aunt in town. I'm the luckiest aunt ever. And I'm so excited because she now only lives, I'm from Cleveland, Ohio, and so is she. And her husband um, got a job down in Kentucky. And so she's only four hours, four hours away. So I see some crafting together. I'm not going to open this up all the way, but these are fibers different fibers. Here is a sand castle. <laughs> she knows how much I love football and both my boys played football and um, my son, my oldest son is also a football, high school football coach. So this will come in handy. Here's one. It's a travel journal. It's got like a little travel. I'm going to take it out. 
it's got like a little travel journal in it <laughs> and an airplane I don't travel that much but um, once we retire my husband and I have both decided we're going to do some traveling so there's a camera and an airplane and some bags and a boat I'm not real fond of um, of um, doing cruising because being around the water makes me nervous but I figure my husband and I can just take turns you know one one trip we'll do an all-inclusive resort and one trip we'll do a cruise so we'll compromise but then in here is this little booklet it's a little travel journal <laughs> Oh my gosh. How cute is that? Let's just set these here. Because there's more decorative more decorative buttons. More memory labels. Um, and these are nice. They're real. Um, they've got dimension to them. Awesome, fantastic, believe, awesome, dream, discover. This I am excited about. Little tags that I can um, stamp on. But also, I don't know where she got these from. But these are all burlap. These are all burlap. And, um, being that I am on the design team for Canvas Core, um, how much fun that I can use, you know, Tattered Angels and Seven Gypsies and other Canvas Home Basics, um, things on these to experiment with and to also use as embellishments and projects that I can share with you as part of the Canvas, as part of the creative crew for Canvas Core. So I was really excited to see that. And then um, some floral pins, which will be great because, you know, you can always add beads. And um, I like to make homemade beads. And um, this would be great for putting homemade beads on. Or just beads that you buy at the store and then add them to your layouts. Add them to your mixed media projects. And then there's these. Oops, sorry, I'm out of frame. It says, being a woman is a terribly difficult trade since, it's consists, since it consists principally of dealing with men. Two peas in a pod. Girls just want to have fun. Girlfriend. Wild thing, you make my heart sing. <laughs> and she does make my heart sing. And um, some of these. And um, some um, stickers. But this is awesome. And she's just, a, she's just a doll. An absolute doll to do this for me. Oh my gosh. Ashley Lynn, I love you to the moon and back. And here's some more. There's some borders and some more stickers to put on. And these um, in here, I'm not quite sure how to, well, actually, I'm not positive how to use them, but I have an idea. And it has to, this is, um, chart pack not a sticker not a decal looks and feels looks and feels just like real etched glass all fun cut rub and done no mess no cleanup um i i have um i have an idea for this that um i'm going to share and um, she gave me a couple of them. So um, they're grapevines. Hmm. What would you want to put 
on a grape, what would you want to use grapevines to decorate? Hmm. Ha 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 ha. I have some great ideas for this. That. And then <laughs> she sent me some more beautiful, beautiful stickers. I'm sorry, these are rub-ons. These ones are decals. These ones are rub-ons. And these are upside down. Do I have them upside down? Probably. But how beautiful would these look in an art journal page or on a scrapbook page? Um, just beautiful. Just, just beautiful. And of course, last but not least, some beautiful doilies. Um, I love using doilies in my artwork. And these are gorgeous. I don't know if you can see, but they're also, they've got texture in the middle as well as around the outside. Isn't that pretty? So this is my happy mail gift that I got from my beautiful, beautiful niece, Ashley, who lives down in Kentucky, um, who I just love with all my heart. I'm very blessed to have some beautiful nieces and one, and I, I love all of them, but Ashley's really kind of special to me because I was there when, um, when her mom found out that she was pregnant with her because it was the exact same doctor's appointment where I, um, was officially declared unpregnant after having my son. So I got to go, you know, I got to watch her mom be pregnant, you know, with her and I was at the hospital when she was born and I held her in my arms when she was just, you know, an hour old and I, but all of this love, <clears throat> all of this love was sent to me from one of the kindest, sweetest young ladies that God has blessed my life with. So Ashley Lynn, from the bottom of your Aunt Leslie's heart, thank you so much. I hope you enjoy Christmas morning with your baby girl and your brand new husband um, tomorrow morning, which as of right now, according to my clock, it's 12, 12 a.m. So Merry Christmas and thank you for everything. Um, and she's coming up to see me on Monday to spend Monday and Tuesday with me. Then she's going to drive back to Kentucky. But so we're going to do some playing. But also from Scrapping Life Away, from my husband, Jim and I, um, and our three kids, Samantha, Kevin, and Donnie, and my daughter-in-law, Katrina, my future um, son-in-law, Tim, my grandbabies, Liam, Chloe, and Penelope. From the bottom of our hearts, Merry Christmas, Happy Hanukkah, Happy Kwanzaa. If you celebrate or don't celebrate, please take this time to enjoy your families and give each other a hug. Thank you. Bye-bye, y'all.